Local boxer is determined to turn his gym into a community center, but the road to rebuild what was once an abandoned building on the city's northwest side has not been easy. CBS's News Detroit's Lauren Winfrey brings us the story from Puritan Street and Indiana Avenue. Tony says when you walk around Puritan on the city's northwest side, you may not see much. That's why he's designing a gym that draws people in and gets kids off the street. A decorated boxer. At five years old, my mom put me in boxing, and I never turned back from Dedicated to Detroit. Because nobody will put money in our area. Boxing champ Tony Superbad Harrison is not only determined to put Detroit boxing back on the map, he also wants to leave his mark on the city too. I, I think this is a diamond in the rough for us. He's referring to his boxing gym, Superbad Fitness, on Puritan in Indiana. He says he wanted to invest in an area starved for resources. There's nothing up and down Puritan. It's literally nothing, um, but you see kids all day running outside, running up and down the street. Harrison bought the building back in 2015 and has since rehabbed most of it, despite three different contractors taking off with money and failing to complete work on the building's roof. Harrison says it's been a frustrating feat, but he isn't deterred. We've actually progressed, to be honest. You know, we, we, we definitely progressed. Um, you know, I probably got like half of the building done already. Um, but this, like I said, the third guy that was fixing it just never came back. Costing Harrison nearly $100,000 in money lost for services that weren't rendered. Still, he says he's committed to Detroit, his gym, and bringing boxing back to the city. In the, in the 80s and 90s, it was, it was Detroit. It was no other place but Detroit. My whole dream was just to bring good boxing back to Detroit. So that's why I never left. Reporting on the city's northwest side, Lauren Winfrey, CBS News, Detroit.